guys so welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl minami and i'm back again with another youtube video so your first time on my channel you're very much welcome i'm minami extra a youtuber based in manchester uk and you're very much welcome grab some wine popcorn champagne anything i got you okay subscribe down below because it's absolutely free if you're a returning subscriber mm, thank you so much like you guys are the real MVP. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I achieved these beautiful nails. They are gel nails and I did them all by myself. And I'm here to show you guys how you can achieve that too, okay? You know, I got you. I got you, okay? Like, okay. I don't know why I'm being too dramatic. On the normal, I'm dramatic. But uh, look at my nails though. Look at that. It's the shine for me. It's the nails for me. It's everything for me. Like, period. You know when you have nice nails, you go to a party and you're just like, and you break a taxi, you're just like. So all the products I use are from Madame Glam. This video is not sponsored. They just sent me some of their goodies for me to try out. And they turned out so good. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to share this with my girls. I can't keep the secret no more because... I want all my girls to have very beautiful nails and you know one thing about gel nails here they are very very long lasting they're still shiny all the way through so this is what they sent me came in a box like this and look at this look at this look at this cuties so the colors they sent me are supreme pink they sent me perfect red which i use to get my nails done I tell you this red is actually really perfect like look at this and red is such a mature color it's such a vibe is and you're free tonight like this this name is so weird because it's long and whatever they also sent me their UVD LED lamp this is my all-time favorite from what they sent me this lamp ha, is a game changer so it comes like this it's very small and portable you can literally fit it into your purse handbag you can just hold it like this it's so flexible travel friendly you're going on vacation or anything like that just grab this switch up your nail polish every time madame glam got you imagine having everything you love at your fingertips mm -mm -mm. please that's the life i want so this UVD lamp is what you use to dry your nail polish because gel nail polish cannot dry normally like the way the regular nail polish dries. So you need a UVD lamp like you're going to see in the video later on. So this lamp came with a USB cable which you can connect to a power bank, your laptop. That's why I said it's so good. So you can connect it to a power bank, your laptop or directly to a power supply and you just dry your nails easy peasy imagine just sitting at the back of your car or at the coffee shop literally but who does your nails at the coffee shop though just anywhere and you're just flexible enough connect it to your power bank connect it to your laptop and that's it so enough of the rants let's get straight into how i got these nails done starting off i placed all the products i'm going to be using to get my nails done on this work surface that is the mini uvd lamp some acetone or nail polish remover the cortex or the nail polish and some cutting pads i went ahead to do some artificial extensions but that's optional that's why i didn't show it in the video because you can as well just apply this gel nail polish to your natural nails but i wanted it longer so the first thing you do this applies to both gel um this applies to both having it on artificial nails or normal nails is to put some nail polish remover or acetone on a cutting pad and clean your nails this helps to remove any oil or dead dyes on your nails prior to you applying your nail polish so i quickly cleaned everything like you see me do and my nails were set for all that we're about to do after this i took out the products i'm going to be using which is the base coat the nail polish and the top coat 
just like the name describes base coat that's the first thing you're going to be applying on your nails or artificial extensions before applying your gel nail polish in applying your base coat you want to place your hands on a flat surface such that it's more steady and easier for you to apply because the tendency is when you're applying nail polish or anything to your nails by yourself you might get a little bit shaky but i was doing it the opposite way because i wanted you guys to have a better view of what i'm doing that's why i'm not placing my hands on the surface instead i'm just kind of suspending it so you have a better view of what i'm doing and you're also going to notice i did apply the base coat on four um fingers first four fingernails in first because the mini uvd lamp is small and you can put your five fingers in it at the same time so after applying the base coat i'm going to put it inside the uvd lamp and i'm going to let it dry for about 45 seconds to 60 seconds and after that this is what they looked like and as you can see my nails are already so shiny and ready for the gel nails i'm going to repeat the same process i did on my four other fingernails i'm going to do it on my thumb and let that dry then proceed in applying my nail polish as you can see my nails are all shiny and ready to apply the nail polish so i grabbed my nail polish and i'm going to apply the first layer of the polish and this is the key to applying gel nail polish or getting your gel nails done you don't want to you want to go in with one layer at a time it's going to better help the nails to cure and help each layer to dry properly and also helps in the overall longevity of your nails the base coat which we applied earlier helps your nails to last longer and helps the polish to last longer. You know what they say about having a solid foundation. So that's the role that your base coat is playing. So after that, I grabbed my cutting pad and I'm just going to clean around. It's normal that when doing your nails by yourself, you might get a little bit shaky because you don't have stable hands and it's going to cause you to make errors here and there. And that's where your cutting pad or cutting board comes in handy because you're going to be able to clean up any mistakes that you make. But beware, it's important to clean off any um, polish that gets on your skin or gets where you don't want it to be before you put your nails to cure under the UVD lamp. Because once you put it under the UVD lamp, it makes it more difficult to take out the polish because it has already dried if that makes sense so you want to after you just apply the polish you go ahead with your cutting pad to clean all around it then you let it dry then you proceed so this was the second layer i was applying everything was already looking so nice like i said you go in with one layer at a time and the reason why you're going in with different layers is because you're trying to build up the colors there are some colors that you need to go in with about three layers or more like even four layers for the colors to be pronounced mostly like nude colors or stuff like that but with this red polish as you can see with the second layer of the polish it was already looking really nice but since i'm extra i wanted the color to be more intense so i went in with the third layer and with every step you just do the same thing apply the polish take out any and clean out any errors that you may have made so far if you're finding this video helpful do also give it a thumbs up and comment down below what you think are you going to try this out have you ever considered doing your nails by it yourself and also a plus about using products from madame glam the products are vegan cruelty free how amazing is that and also i have a discount code which i'm going to link down below just in case you want to try out their products you want to get some cash off then do all to use my discount code so so far this is what our nails are looking like it's looking really 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 nice and at this point i've used these nails for about two weeks and they still look really nice and shiny so i'll definitely recommend that you guys try this out so this is what it was looking so far i was in love i'm going to quickly apply the third layer then do the same thing to my thumb apply my top coat and i'll be right back
after applying three coats of the nail polish this is what it looked like so beautiful so the last step you're going to use your top coat and go all over the nails it's going to add extra shine give it the yummy effect and oh like you can see these nails are fire let me know down below what you think about these nails do you think it turned out well are you going to be willing to try doing your nails by yourself just let me know let's chat down below what you think about the results were they nice what's your favorite color of nail polish and yeah let's just talk about nails so once i was done applying my top coat i went ahead with my cutting pad and a little bit of nail polish remover and i'm just going to quickly clean my nails and this step is very optional what i normally do is i'll just go to the sink and wash my hands just to take out any to take out any dust cutting or dirt that may have gone to your nails just in this process or if you're multitasking you're touching fabrics or anything there might be little particles so you just maybe wash your hands or clean it like you see me do then you can apply maybe your coconut oil or any oil just to moisturize your hands and make everything look nice fresh and pink this were the end results i was so happy and like i said i definitely recommend shop from madame glam and don't forget to use my discount code down below see you guys on my next video thanks for watching bye